Hello everybody, my name is Ricky Nelson and welcome to The Vent. I know it's been a couple of weeks and yes, I'm very sorry about that. I was just handling so much that I couldn't necessarily multitask on that kind of level. So I decided to prioritize and push out things as I saw fit. But now I have some time, I am able to get back to this because this is important to me. Um, so this week, what I want to talk about is... It's going to touch on something a bit sensitive. So, I do not know about you guys, but I couldn't bring myself to watch the DJ Evolve video. I, the mere thought of it is heart-wrenching, because this is a young man whose life is now completely changed. He's never going to be able to go back to who he was. He needs to start building an understanding that from now, henceforth, this is my life this is what it's gonna be and i need to prepare for it i need to be i need to place myself in the best position to take advantage of it or at the very least to live it and this situation presents our government and more so our judiciary system with a perfect opportunity to change our minds in the past there have been a lot of negative things said about our government there have been a lot of negative things said about our judiciary system. And I can't speak on the legalities of it all because I'm not a lawyer. I can only speak as a human because, yeah, I, do, I am qualified to that point. I am a human being. And I think this is the best time for you guys to show us who you really are, you know? We are all paying attention. We are all listening. So this is your opportunity. So you're either going to prove us right with everything that we have said, every opinion that we have of you that is very negative at this time, or, or you could change our minds. It's that simple. Just do something. Um, so I just want to point something out. Um, I realize that I can no longer just do this on YouTube. So I'm going to be sharing and posting my videos across any platform that I have access to. So um, I hope that this helps me get my content and my stuff to more eyeballs because that's essentially the end game. Uh, YouTube is the best because it lets me track my progress it's fantastic but if you're watching this on Facebook you're watching it on Instagram on Twitter it doesn't really matter as long as you're watching it yeah my, my director is helping me today uh, she showed up in the previous video you can hear her talking to me right now she's giving me instructions but yes I'm gonna summarize before she ends this video um, yeah so just check out my stuff uh, the best thing you could ever do for me is share my videos with your friends I will really appreciate it. Mob love. So I, th I thought of breaking down my channel into different segments. And uh, this is my next segment, which is just touching on things that have gone on during the week. So secondly, we woke up today. Today is the 4th of July. Yes, on Independence Day of the United States of America, we woke up to a tweet from Kanye West that announces that he is going to be running for president of the United States of America. And I know your first instinct is to laugh, but I want you to think about this. It was just a, mo a morning just like this a couple of years ago, and we woke up to the news that Donald Trump was planning on running to be America's next president. And we laughed. Look at us now. Lastly, my last segment is, I don't even know if I'm going to put this in because uh, I'm not, I just thought about this today and well, here goes. So my last segment is just going to be general weird stuff that I think about that I relate to that interests me. And if you get this, then it's official proof that like me and you could really vibe on a personal level. Uh, if you don't, it doesn't mean anything, uh, it's fine, it's not a problem, you don't have to get off the channel, as in, uh, you might find today's topic might not be your thing, but next week's is going to be your thing, so stick around, who knows. 
so I tweeted about this a couple of weeks ago and my tweet said do you know that the phrase kukata maji is to a point biologically correct uh, kukata maji is slang in Kenya for drinking as in uh, it, it's yes that, that's what it is so when you think about it it's actually a biological fact because one of the effects of alcohol in our bodies is dehydration and kukata maji can loosely translate to the removal of water or removing water so when you say nakata maji i'm removing water so it kind of translates to dehydration so you're actually removing water from your body thus proving the fact that kukata maji is an actual biological term what you think about that for those of you who have not please subscribe to my channel you can do so by clicking on the little red button underneath this video go ahead and hit that little bell icon so you can be notified whenever i put up a new video and by the looks of things you're gonna need it because i don't really know what i'm gonna be able to do these things because yeah life gets in the way for those of you who already have thank you for those who have done it right now thank you even more and once again my name is ricky nelson and this is the vent.